in Northern Ireland, BBC Children in Need, is able to support some 200 projects working with disadvantaged children and young people all over uh, Northern Ireland in every county and that's a portfolio with a grant value of over £8 million uh, working to help children who have perhaps got a disability, maybe they're living uh, with the effects of poverty, maybe they've been bullied, maybe they're bereaved um, or maybe they have some kind of illness um, and the projects that we support are able to build on their strengths and give them the chance uh, to have a great childhood. It's been fantastic. It's been a really exciting week. Lots of activity in-house here in the BBC with uh, Hugo's auction, Radio Ulster auction. He's well over 27,500 now um, and still still growing. Um, and outside we've had lots of, of support, both corporate support and local support. And every penny goes to our grants. So that's tremendous, whether it's a child's pocket money or whether it's a major corporate sponsorship. It all works and helps. Well, always hoping to, to, to get a bit more, but we're conscious it's hard times. Um, but certainly last year in the final total was over £49 million across the UK. But on the night uh, here in Northern Ireland, we were able to raise over 700000 So we're hoping that tonight we'll be able to, to, to match that. Donate anyway. You can donate on our website, bbc.co.uk slash pudsey. Or, or you can put money into any bank or building society, or you can send a postal order, or you can send a cheque here into BH, any way at all. You can even bring in a bucket of money. It is indeed, and we offer hairdressing training, retail, catering, warehousing and hospitality. So every year, um, Belfast Central Training chooses a charity that they're going to raise some money for, and this year we chose Children in Need. We have been running all week um, lots of different activities for the students and even some of the customers within the salon to take part in. It started off at the start of the week with a bun sale and tuck shop. At that we also had sweet cones and throughout the week some of the retail students have gone out into the streets of Belfast and started to sell these um, just to everybody on the street and it just resulted in a complete sellout. So that went really well. The salon itself has been offering five pound curly blow dries all week for anyone who wants to avail of that. And we've also had a raffle for guests the number of sweets in the jar and for a fantastic chocolate cake as well. We've raised a fantastic amount of £286 so far and with the tuck shop there's still a few bits and pieces left so we'll continue to do that fundraising into next week as well.